Hello Minecraft fans, Dave Chaos here, and today I have another mod spotlight for you, and this one is Animal Bikes. You may have seen this before, but um, I've not done a review on it yet, so I'm going to do one. I've got myself a nice fresh spawn, little town over there, and, and a nice little field. So here we go, we're going to start with the, um, the cow bike. Now I've decided that I'm not going to go through all the crafting because it's quite long and tedious and it can take quite a while. Um, so I'm in creative mode, I'm just going to spawn in the items and show you what they can do. So without further ado, the cow bike, um, it's depicted by the image that's there. I mean, I, I mean you can look at that, it doesn't look like a cow to me, but anyway, let's, let's just crack on with it. Uh, you just right click, oh bloody hell, started with a baby one already, I was going to say there's a 20% chance that it'll spawn a baby cow. But let's go, there we go. Yay! Coloured cows. Now, you can dye them on your own, but if you just keep like going for it, you'll end up with different coloured cows. There you go. I can't believe how many baby ones I'm getting. <laughs> there we go, so let's hop on. Right. <laughs> Sorry, getting a bit giddy. Um, cows can jump two blocks high, so as you can see when I'm jumping off, he actually gets damaged. Doink, like that. Now if I just hop off this cow and give him a mushroom, check this out. Here cow, eat the mushroom. Mushroom, yeah, it turns into a mushroom. Check it out. <laughs> and then you can just ride this about. Yeah. And actually, they're not too shabby, you know, they can move quite fast. Whoa, check that out. Nice. So, let's move on to the next one. So, I just want to point out, mushrooms can't fly. <laughs> um, so the next one's the pig bike. Um, again, this has got a 20% chance to spawn a baby one. And the baby ones are 30% slower than normal. Now, the pig bikes don't have any special abilities like the mushroom one, but if I just get on them, they're extremely fast. Check it out. Yeah. And of course, don't stop running. If you press forward, you just keep going. So all you've got to do is jump, jump, hop! Hey, you made it! Jump! So there you go, you just don't stop running. You don't have to touch any buttons. you just got to worry about jumping. So that's the pig bike. Pretty simple, other than it being super fast. Um, oh yeah, of course, to make it go faster, you just press forward. You see that? See how it's running fairly normal there? That's on autopilot. And then press forward, and he's off. Super fast pig! Yay! <laughs> then we've got the the sheep bike. Um, nothing special here. It's slightly faster than the cow. Um, and of course, again, you've got 20% chance to spawn a baby one. These guys don't really do anything different. And, and all the bikes, I believe, can be died if you just walk up to them and hit them with some die. So a little bit faster. Ah, we not quite make that then. Um, but yeah, the sheep bikes are pretty boring. Ah! Then we've got the, then we've got the chicken bike. So these little guys. Yes, again, twenty percent chance to spawn a baby one. There we go, a baby one. <laughs> but they're slower than normal, so let's just get a normal. I don't. Let's get a decent colour. Come on, come on. Where's me racing blue chicken? That'll do. This guy. So their ability, let's find that hole, they're, pretty, they're just slightly faster than walking speed, but their ability is slow fall, so let's hop off. Wee Oh. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
is pretty slow on land, but it's awesomely fast in the water. So let's just spawn him on land and take him into the water so you can see what I'm talking about. Here we go, it's the quid bike. So he's pretty slow on water, but watch this. Wait, watch, 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 watch. <gasps> yeah! So this is an awesome, awesome thing if you're uh, wanting to travel across water and you've got this mod installed. Get yourself a squid bike. They do spawn as well, by the way. All these things can spawn in the wild. Um, yeah, so that's that's another fucking awesome perk. And hop out to the water, and yeah, they become all really slow and boring. Now we get into the interesting bikes. Um, this one's the creeper bike. Doesn't look anything like a creeper. Oh, and look at that. First one is a charged one. Awesome. So these guys behave just like you'd expect from a normal charged creeper. Um, when they blow up, of course. And yes, you can blow these guys up. Uh, so... They're pretty fast, and the sun's going down, so I'll try and get this guy demonstrated as quick as I can. <laughs> so there's the creeper bike, and they will blow up. Oh, no, no, don't go down there! Oh. Damn. Hang on. They will blow up when they're on less than 5% health, so here's a normal one. Bloody hell. Come here! Come here! Come blow up! Show everybody! Show everybody you like to blow up. I'm in the dark, I, I, you probably can't even see this. There he goes! Yay! <laughs> so that's the creeper bike for you, and of course you have a chance of spawning a charged one. But if you just keep going for it, I'm sure you will get one eventually, like so. Yay! Okay, I've spawned a new world because I don't have time to wait for the sun to go around. Um, the next one is the ponies one. So this is like the My Little Ponies stuff. Oh, God. I I'm just going to go over it as I've gone over the others because otherwise I'll be here forever. There's 54 different ponies. So there, there we go. So you, you can be here all day trying to get all the different types of ponies to spawn. <laughs> but... The four main important ones you're going to want to know about is you have ground ground ponies, which are like this one. Ground ponies, um, if they walk over dirt, it'll turn into grass. So if we had some dirt around, maybe... Hang on a minute, let's hop off. Let's get some dirt on the go. Come here, pony. Come here. Come here. Come here. Right. So if she walks over the sea, turns into grass. Ah, look. <laughs> and um, and of course, random flowers will spawn as well when you walk over the dirt. So let's cover up all the dirt. There we go. We've got a few flowers on that last block. Come on. There we go. So that's the ground ponies. That's what they'll do. They spawn random flowers all over the place and turn dirt into grass. Um, if we can get ourselves a unicorn pony like this one. Um, it it has rainbow glitters. I don't know. If, there we go. Can you see them? There you go. Look, it's got glittery rainbow. Ah, oh, I feel like I could puke. <laughs> My God. And of course, it's it just spams flowers everywhere. <sighs> there we go. Rainbow glitters. Um, I forgot to mention that this mod is also available on multiplayer, so if you've got your modded client and a modded server, you can actually all play together with these. <laughs> and then you've got an alley corn pony, and um, they do all of the above. So I'm not sure if this is... If they've got wings, they can fly. Yeah, there we go. So he flies, he, he has sparkles coming out of his ass. He did his spawning bland, random flowers everywhere, and oh, yeah, so there you go. You can do everything. And there's 54 different types of the My Little Ponies ponies. Enjoy that one. So, the next one we're going to look at is the Ender one, which is one creepy looking bleeding mount. Look at the state of it. Oh, and he's off. There he goes. He <laughs> doesn't look too happy with it, though. Look, look at him. Anyway, right, the Ender one. Oh. He can, he can, right, let's start from the top. He will teleport with spacebar, so let's get one, let's get on him. He will teleport with spacebar, pew, randomly. I'm not sure if he'll go where you want him to. And he doesn't seem to want to teleport. Yeah, if I look over there, 
he should. There we go. Yeah, he's, he's been a little bit buggy. And of course, you may have noticed, he will walk up a, a one block. So if you've got one block in front of you there, he'll actually walk up it like this. There we go. Um, you can, it, he always teleports forward-ish uh, with a 20 block. There we go. See how far that was quite far. And he'll, it'll be about 20 blocks distance. 24 blocks. And um, can't teleport while you're in water. And he also gets damaged in water, as you would expect. So that is the Creeper Enderman mount. I mean, look at the state of it. It's hideous. It's terrifying. I don't think I want to walk around on one of them all day. Here's a more fun one for you. This is a Notch head. There we go. So it's Notch's head. Come say hello, Notch. Hello. There we go. Um, the perks of this one is a bit weird. He, he likes to give out cookies. Um, doesn't give out too many cookies, though. And he will actually try to eat you. <laughs> so, I don't know. Let's, let's get on him. Yeah, he's pretty fast. Not too shabby on the speed there. Let's, there we go. And we're off. There we go, there goes the cookie, do you see that? But apparently it doesn't give out too many though, it's not just a bit tight with the cookies. Next one is the reindeer one, which is a bit of a festive Christmassy one, but there we go. It does everything you'd expect a reindeer to do. So if you get on him, he will fly. Yay! A flying mount, check it out. Of course I'm saving the best one till last, you all know what that's going to be. So there's your reindeer one, little bits of snowflakes coming off him. <laughs> it's pretty cool actually. Shame it's just so Christmassy orientated. So that's what he does. Doesn't do a great deal at else. But flying is pretty spectacular. Everybody wants to be able to fly in Minecraft, especially if you can do it in your single player mode. And next is the snow golem mount. Now this poor little guy. He just looks he just looks so hard done to him. Look at him! Oh my god. Oh, poor guy. Let's let's hop on him. Let's go. So this guy will actually fire snowballs. Check that out. All you got to do is press the space bar. And as usual, the snow golem he leaves a massive trail of snow everywhere. Let's go. Pew, pew. Oop, sorry. Yikes. Nearly smashed him to pieces then. So there we go. Snow golem. It's like your own personal snowball tank thing. <laughs> So I've saved the best till last, as co of course, and uh, it is of course the Ender Dragon. This is what everybody's going to be like. Oh my God, an Ender Dragon! Just you wait, check this out. Okay, Ender Dragon, bam, one Ender Dragon. Okay, let's get a better colour than that. There, red Ender Dragon. Check this out. Okay, this is awesome, and look at the way he moves. He's so majestic, and if we go down with a flint and steel and. Burn, baby, burn! Oh, yeah! <laughs> burn everything. <laughs> oh, he's terrible. Look at it. Yes, it's, it's not terrible. What am I talking about? It's awesome. So, the Ender Dragon. Fire breathing evil monster Ender Dragon. Burn everything. Burn. Burn, sheepy, burn! <laughs> and. As you can imagine, you can have hours of fun with this guy. And, uh, and as usual, he flies by, spacebar to go up, crouch to go down, and you just right click him with flint and steel to make him breathe fire! Burn, sheepies! <laughs> oh yeah. Off into the sunset, because we own this world. <laughs> 